John Cena. Yeah. joining us. Thank you, everyone. How is everyone today? Yeah. Pat McAfee, how are you, sir? I'm fantastic. You know, the biggest WrestleMania of all time had a uh, a John Cena surprise appearance. Yes. Nice surprise! Oh, wow! Wow! You can hear the energy and the excitement here at the convention center. Pat McAfee, crew, how is everyone? Fantastic, Fabulous. John. All right, uh, guys, I'm not wearing headphones, so you might have to talk a little bit loud, but I wanted to be in the element. I wanted to yeah. hear and uh, experience the sound and the excitement of the tail end of WrestleMania week. WWE World, you're ruining the brand. WWE World, yeah. WWE The World. The though. World, WWE The World. That might mm. be the next name. Yeah. Uh, Includes Saturday. Uranus. No, that would be the universe. Solar Eclipse today, if we're going to start talking about this. <laughs> right. Solar Eclipse, let's make sure we're looking up at the moon. Blocking the sun, it should be a good day, buddy. Don't, it was don't, great. I mean, look up at it with the proper equipment. Don't just look up at it. Thank you, John Cena. Because yep. yeah. you won't be Boom. able to see me oh, or anyone else. Yeah, you yeah. can't see yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Safety first. <laughs> Safety first out there. Uh, last night, I see you make that 55-yard sprint. Oh, it was an unorthodox jog, but yes, I made it. <laughs> you made it. You looked phenomenal. Don't trip. How That's... good How good did it feel to get back in there? And, oh, uh... how, how good does it feel to run down the ramp at WrestleMania in front of a crazy group of fans like this? Spectacular. You, I mean, you get to go out there every night, and you get, to, you get the best seat in the house to call all the action. We, we share the same moments. We share the same love for the business. We share the same love for WWE. So, uh, yeah, it, it, it felt great. You coming out and helping Cody. Yeah. Same with the dead man, Undertaker, uh -huh. coming yep. out. And if you listen to what Miz said earlier, Miz was like, hey, Undertaker has always been known as the leader. Of the Look at you. You're moving, dude. You're uh, that's, moving. That's a lot of camera tricks right there. No. Oh, we saw it. It's no. a lot of sports four, four, uh, entertainment. Right there. Look, that's a long sprint. That's a hamstring <laughs> or two yeah. waiting, especially with how chilly it was. You look damn good, and obviously you came in and a little attitude adjustment for the this tribal chief. Oh. Hey, the bloodline set the table, man. They said uh, anything goes, so I just happened to make it on time, and anything goes, you know? Yeah, and obviously a Spanish announced desk got cleared off uh, because yeah, we had some... No, there is no way that that can stand to WrestleMania and not be broken, and I saw that it wasn't broken. Oh, oh man. Put a body through it. it. <laughs> Clean. <laughs> Let's put a body through it, uh, but Miz talked about how The Undertaker comes out to help Cody Rhodes, and that's like the leader of the locker room for so long, so him being a part of it is a huge deal, obviously stamping a new era. You coming out and helping, especially because Cody, big baby face, obviously, you coming out is like the dawning of a, coming to help a new era. Is that how you saw it? Is that how you feel? And So the great thing about WWE, right, is we can all speculate on, on everything it means, and we all have our own opinion. If anyone more, knows more about that than me, I, I'd be hard pressed to find that individual because for 20 <laughs> years, I've run down that ramp to a very mixed response. I understand that the audience is allowed to have their own opinion or allowed to speculate on what this could mean. If, if you know anything about me, you know that I try to, I wear my values on my sleeve. Words like never give up, hustle, loyalty, and respect. And I always want a fair chance. That's it. So in the biggest event of the year, with our most important prize on the line, I am just an advocate for a fair chance. Okay. You know I'm a huge fan of Cody Rhodes, but you also know I'm a huge fan of Roman Reigns. I believe Roman Reigns is the greatest of all time. Okay. Again, again, what's great about WWE is you can have your opinion and you can voice yours, and I think that's fantastic. Will, Co will Cody Rhodes be the greatest of all time? He's put himself in a good position. They're saying you're the GOAT, pal. What is that? They're saying you're, you're. The, you're the GOAT. This is a barn. You're the GOAT. Oh, Mike. Me, aww. <laughs> wow. That's more of a donkey. Thank, thank yeah. you. That's more like a jackass. Yeah. Oh, you're yeah. GOAT. That's, that's more me. That's yeah. more me. No, no. First of all, thank you so much. 
Because I, I, I know you don't just do that for anybody, so thank you. It means the world. Thank you. But to your point there, you were saying, is Cody Rhodes going to be the greatest of all time? We'll find out. TV. Yeah, and that does. That's what you get when you do a live show, man. Hey, this is what you get when you bust your ass for decades. Thank you. Thank you. So going going back to what I said about Roman Reigns, uh, that doesn't mean that Cody Rhodes cannot be the greatest of all time. I just want people to understand that. I think what's been done so far, you have to put Roman Reigns in that slot. But Cody's Cody's story set, you know, the whole the whole theme of WrestleMania was finishing the story. His story starts today. I t I told him in the ring last night, and I'm sure he'll be able to relay this same message. When I got to embrace him, I, he had the championship in his right hand, and I said, "Do you feel that?" He said, "Yes." I said, "Do you feel how heavy it is?" He said, "Yes." I said, "It will get heavier every day." Oh, that's deep. Because that is the burden you bear of trying to craft the path to being the greatest of all time. I hope, I hope, and this is, should be the goal for the business, every performer should pass the torch up. So I hope a year from now, two years from now, three years from now, we can all sit here and be an advocate that Cody Rhodes is the greatest of all time, because that's the way it should work. Awesome. You're speaking from a man who has obviously been there, done that, getting go chance, so obviously you should be taken seriously, but wrestling fans are obviously going to be pissed about something you said in there. I love it. Something That's you said the in there. That's the beauty of what we do, man. It is, it is not universally accepted. What is universally accepted is the passion, is the oh. energy, is the heartbeat. We all come together over this, and we all share our opinions loud and vocal, and everyone in the WWE, both talent, production, and audience alike, knows that we are superstars, and that you are a superstar. Yeah, they're a character. Yeah. Yeah. You. 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 And you. With, you. Without, you. without you, you. I'm, I'm just a dude in jean shorts, a ball cap, and a t-shirt. And kicking ass. Hell yeah. yeah. And oh, kicking ass in the middle of the ring. Yeah. Without them, I'm not. Yeah, but they could be no people in our COVID. Anyways, oh, AJ's got a question. And sidebar, I know they were busting your ass about wearing the same t-shirt as last you. night. I'm also wearing the same t-shirt as last oh. night. So we're good. Me and John Cena. You and I, we're good. Of course. Right, hey, you guys are basically oh. twins. John, I wanted to uh, ask you about your life outside the ring. Yeah, let this go. You need to soak it up. They don't get it, John. They don't get it. I'll, I'll change my shirt, but you guys know that comes with a uniform change. So uh, last night wasn't my last night, so this doesn't mean this is my last uniform. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Right on. What's that mean? What's that mean? We're just throwing. A, that means that uh, I've, I've speculated a lot about when it is that I hang up the jorts, but uh, it is. It wasn't last night, and I still got. I still got a little bit of rubber left on the tops. Wow! That feels big. I don't want to bogart your question. Let's get down to, get down to brass. Now that just turned that's into my big. question. Hey, that's breaking news there. Yeah, right yeah. that's nuts. Hey, yeah, baby John. Good we to can, see you. We can lean into that. We Have you been feeling that, that for a while? Did last night reignite that that fire, that passion? Why is it so tough to, to say like, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna put this down. I'm gonna put this away for a while, where I'm not going so, to wrestle. Uh, so it's not tough because of the foundation I laid and the promise I made to each and every person who pays attention and gives of themselves to WWE. When I feel I can no longer perform at the capacity of the product, it is time to step away. That's not that's not tough. Okay. The toughest thing is that I love it so much, uh, and I, you can still do it at a high level. Uh, yeah. So when that when that time is gone, that means that it's done. I'm I'm actively trying to craft that path right now. So uh, I, I've I've put a line in the sand of myself for for 50, and I honestly think it's going to be before that. Uh, there's your breaking news. Oh, hold it, hold it. Uh, I'll be 47 in a few weeks. Oh, so we got time right. still. Uh, you, you got about 700, about 1,000 days to decide. Okay, okay. okay. All right. And, and a lot of time. Nothing but, but time. Um, but you got this, many are calling this the greatest WrestleMania ever, right? And, and I agree, what a spectacle, what a fantastic WrestleMania. But that's because of the talent that actually put the time in. I showed up for 90 seconds. This is the greatest WrestleMania with or without my involvement. And, and that well, is because of the now, the superstars we have now and their contribution, their contribution to the business. It is gonna be time soon for me to go. 
and I, I'm embracing that and enjoying it, and it allows me to be present. Go, 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 go. I, uh, I can say this with the utmost certainty. I will always, always be part of the WWE family, but the time to compete in the ring is coming to a close. No! Yeah. No, we have, we have no. thousand, thousand days. days. We have thousand days. No, we have less. thousand days. I'm going to try to do it in less. Okay. okay. Well, whatever the case, you look fantastic Thank last you night. Very much. You said 90 seconds. Average 47 year old, that run out there is taking <laughs> yeah. Yeah. at least four minutes. For sure. 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 17, 
one of these days it, it might have to come at like a hall of fame or something but i i want to be able to thank the ww universe for getting me ready for life um and the skills that i learned performing in front of a live audience that is very vocal about how they feel when something is good or when something is not gives you immediate feedback it gives you timing it allows you to focus on storytelling if i'm not entertaining you SOBs are going to tell me I'm not entertaining. Yep. So I better sharpen my skills real quick and be entertaining. If uh, I stumble, if I pause, if I'm not on my best on oh, Monday or Friday. Oh, the sound. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. You guys let me know. You guys have prepared me to take the skill set that I've learned in WWE and, and put it forth in movies and in life. And before, when I did movies, I just wanted to be back in the ring. I was a young 20-something-year-old invincible WWE champion that wanted to be in front of this audience. Now I understand that my, my body can only do that in select times. But I have all these skills that you've given me, and I want to be able to use those skills in the frame that I have. And on movies and in television is the best way to do, the, do that. And I've, I really compare what's going on in my life right now to like 2006. People in WWE, nobody thought I'd ever be anything. I almost got fired. They didn't think the rap persona would work. One at a time, jump hurdle, jump hurdle, jump hurdle. So I don't mind that everyone typecasts me as like, yo, you, you do this and only this. I'm sure you had some hurdles to the climb, I'd say. being a, a, an NFL <laughs> kicker. Uh, and, swearer, a uh, guy who has a public intoxication arrest, uh, from Indianapolis, punter, right. yes. kind of a doofus. That, this is everybody's journey in life. I'm just so grateful to the skills that you guys have allowed me to develop because, man, do I have an awesome toolkit, and now maybe I can do something else or something else, or I don't know. Okay, so Maybe I can be on the Pat McAfee panel. Who knows? Ooh, yeah. Who knows? Right now, doing great right now. Saving me, pal. Yeah, yeah. saving all of us right now. <laughs> um, he was talking about the Ricky Stanicki character, I think, more specifically. Because in there, there's a lot of Stanicki, big stars. Stanicki, Stanicki. If you're going to do a chant, help me with some promo. Thank you to the people at Amazon. Thank you. Yeah, let's get another one. Yeah, yeah let's get a follow up to that. Hero of the week. <laughs> I mean, phenomenal work in there, Ricky Stanicki. But like your acting chops, you were this clear star of said program. And, you know, talking about the Hollywood world, and he said uh, earlier, seeing you naked on the Oscars stage, the internet immediately a buzz. This is an embarrassment ritual for John Cena to have him go out there for a costume award, okay, and do this. Has there ever been a time where you've been embarrassed to showcase that that is what your body looks like? <laughs> and, and, and how long have you looked like this? And whenever, are you just the guy that if you like the idea, yeah, I'll do it? Because that does seem like the John Cena Hollywood guy is like, because what was the Peacemaker? Yeah. That was some of the most absurd shit of all time. Season two coming up. Oh, so yeah. entertaining though. Yeah. It's like, you don't take yourself serious at all, it feels like in there, and you dive right in. I think that's just who you are, and I don't think people are giving you enough credit so, for that type of thing. So I think, uh, I think I do take it seriously, but I take it seriously. Not- Yourself. Not me looking cool. Because if you try to look cool all the time, you're just chasing a, a perfect, view of yourself that doesn't exist. Man, I know I got a bald spot on the back of my head. I flossed, I flossed it last night at WrestleMania. Hell yeah. yeah. Hair looks good though. Me, does. you, and like seven out of 10 dudes have them. So I don't <laughs> care. I'm not perfect. That's not me. So I think instead of trying to craft every situation to how can I look the strongest or the best, I look at every situ situation of how can we make this the best situation. Ooh. When we go over the Oscar bit and they're like, ah, do you want to wear Spanx or Spandex or a Speedo? No, make me as naked as possible so Disney says it's too naked. <laughs> that's how we no, go I was told somebody told you that. Yeah, I, I, know, did, I didn't know you were a part that's of that. The, uh, that's the funny bit. That's the, that's the gag. That's why everyone's entertained. Yeah. And I think that's what leads to polarizing opinions and that's what leads to interest. And people can have that stuff and say like, oh, this is this, but it, it is what it is. It's for your entertainment to decide what you want. Your cheeks on the Oscars were awesome. Yeah. As we are back on ESPN for hour two, John Cena still joining us here live from the WWE yeah. World.
Con Man's got a question for you. Yeah, John, so making the best out of the situation for Cody Rhodes now going forward. Like, when you get your championship, you know, obviously for Cody in this situation, he's following a guy that is known as the GOAT. Like, how does he go forward and not try and replicate anything of the past and do his own thing? Like, was that hard for you when you got yours to not kind of... Uh so sure was, and I think it was hard for Roman too, um, and certainly hard for Shawn Michaels or Stone Cold Steve Austin. Or what? Austin. What? All, all of those guys had enormous shoes to fill. And the way that they've connected with the audience is, <laughs> we're, we'll get some good audience participation here, what? is by reflecting on history why? But ultimately coming to the conclusion Why? that they should be themselves. Why? Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Hey, that was the most sophisticated usage of the what's, I do believe, yeah. which is why you're John Cena. Um, so you just said, obviously, 1,000 days or whatever uh, until you're 50. That's where you drew the line in the sand. You said you're not done. We'll see you again. You're here on Monday after WrestleMania. Yep. What is your schedule right now? Are we making movies? Are we doing? What do we have going on right so, now? With John Cena uh, as well? I was, I was grateful enough that uh, Honda kind of bumped a commitment I had to be able to do WrestleMania. So I'll go from here to do something with Honda. Hey, are they making flying cars? Is that what you alluded to? They're in the working last on voiceover? it. They're working on it, dude. I was watching that commercial. I hear John Cena's voice, They're and then all of a sudden I see some jets and stuff. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, is that happening? That's awesome. <laughs> They're working on some pretty cool stuff. So I'm going to straight to that. Uh, I have a cool um, keynote appearance with Samsung in Las Vegas. Their theme of the convention is Time Is Now, so they called on yours truly to speak there. I'm very grateful for that. Like that. Your time is up. <laughs> My, My time, time is, is now. now. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I have some more branding stuff to do before I leave for Europe to finish a movie that we started filming before the strike called Heads of State with Priyanka Chopra and Idris Elba, Ooh. and then straight from that to Peacemaker Season 2. That'll, uh, that'll take us through just about Christmas, and I'm crossing my fingers and toes and my heart that maybe, maybe, just maybe, I can take the, I can tell the Hollywood world to pump the brakes for a while and come back to my family for one last run. Oh, oh my God. Yeah. I hope, I don't know, I hope, I'm trying, I hope we'll see what happens. We'd be honored to watch that and witness that, and obviously everybody here would be excited to see one last run.